the benefit. Time for our tale of the tape. There can only be one Lomachenko, Ukraine's finest. He's a former world champion in multiple weight classes. Opie Price, this young fighter won gold at the 2018 European Youth Championships and looks like a future contender for sure. If this fighter knows how to use that reach, this is going to be a shut night. And now we toss it up to the world-renowned ring announcer, Mr. Jimmy Lennon Jr. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. Fighting out of the red corner, presenting the two-time Olympic gold medalist from Ukraine, a tremendous three-division champion of the world, Vasily Lomachenko. Fighting out of the blue corner, the first boxer from Great Britain to win gold at the Youth Olympic Games. From Leeds, England, the Southpaw contender and international super bantamweight champion, Hopi Price. Not too many seats to be had in this arena as the hype continues to build for this showdown. So all I can say, heaven on earth, heaven on earth. And what I say you must obey. Good luck. And that's the opening bell, round one. That left counter was perfectly timed. That's a scoring left hand. Punching power. A lot of high hopes and aspirations from the fans and media alike as we get set for this main event under the sun. Our tactics are everything in this heat. The corner man, that one minute, that one minute is going to be everything. He's got to give me instructions. He's got to cool you down, calm you down, patch you up, and send you out there confident. It is so hard when you're in a fight and it's outside in that heat. Some nice exchanges from both men in this ring. They're so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's going to be a hard night tonight for the judges. We're at the halfway point of this round, and both of these fighters have had their moments. Still could go either way. This round could go either way. Ten seconds to go. Who's going to land the first big shot? Safe to say that last round was a nightmare. Let's see if we can turn it around here. This is one of those situations. You've just been hurt. You've got to get out there again. Be smart. Be sharp. Don't be a fool. Don't get sucked in. Make him fight your fight. Hold him, tie him up just until your head clears again and your legs come back again. Because if you don't, he's going to pop you off. has got to navigate his way out of this. Price couldn't take anymore. Round two, three, four. Wow. At some point, the corner may have to intervene here because this fighter won't stay down. Some fighters, when this happens, this can be heartbreaking. Some fighters, it makes them angry. They want to get back into the mix again. I want to know, what sort of character are we looking at here? Good punch. Nice offensive display, landing that left counter. Final 10 seconds here, and this has not been his round for sure. A 
huge momentum swing that's going to be, considering that round will be 10-8 after the knockdown. Here's the bell to start round three. He got knocked down in the last round. Let's see what he can do here. What a knockdown. You know in the corner now, they're saying, when you get out there, jump on him. Do not give him chance to breathe. Bully him, throw him, push him down, punch him in the back. Keep letting the shots go, because you know the one shake your leg. They're like, and that's it, away from getting stopped. Why aren't they defending? We wanted action, and they are giving us action. They exchange punches. Changes from both men in this round. He threw the hook, didn't land. Perfectly matched, skill for skill, tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you, and so I've got to respect both of them more than happy. Halfway through the round, and there's not a lot separating these two. Round still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Nice counter. Beautiful counter shots. That bell could not have come soon enough for this guy. Leaves him up top. The bell took out. Needs to go up. And here we go to the fourth round. Safe to say that last round was a nightmare. Let's see if we can turn it around here. It was a tough last round. Now you've got to make sure he doesn't put it on him. That's what he's going to try and do. So tie him up, hold him, lean on him. Don't get drawn into a fight. Not yet, not until your senses have come back. So much firepower here. Both want a knockout, you can tell. That counter scores. Nice exchanges from both men in this game. This is not good strategy. Those punches are doing nothing. Skill for skill, tap for tap. Just like a match made in heaven. He's got a massive reach advantage. Let's see if he uses it. Very smart, very sharp. This is a fit young man style that he's got to get inside that long loop. Not many fighters can do that. And just despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. about a one-sided three minutes we just saw. I seriously hope the judges kept their eye on this fight because if they haven't, there's going to be absolute uproar. There's the bell to start round five. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. Just when you thought we'd see a lull in the action, here we go again. Boxing, this is a fist fight. It's bombs away. Lands with the right counter. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. He gets out of the way of that left hand. Left counterpunch will score. He fails to score with that left hook. Nice job landing with that right hand counter. There's a counter shot. Someone tell these two that they can be defensive for a minute if they want to. Very close round with 10 seconds to go.
Pretty dominant round there. Let's see how they respond here in the next round. You can't leave it up to the judges. It's up to you as a fighter, and the corner is back. There's the bell for round six. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. In the early rounds of a fight, you'll see two boxers feel each other out, test each other's power. And I think this boxer has decided I can walk through anything that lands. This is when you get in the ring feeling like you're King Kong because you know you've got a chin that is not going to get dented. Nice counter shot with the right hand. Changes from both men in this round. It's all offense, all the time. Good counter left hand there. He just gets out of the way of that right uppercut. He just missed with that big right hand. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. Ah. Well, it's no secret who has the advantage after that last round. Let's see what they got. Round seven, here we go. Coming off that fantastic last round. Let's see if he can keep his momentum going. Best attributes to have in boxing has nothing to do with boxing. It's how well you can take a punch to the face. What a gift. What a gift it is to have a chin where you know you can walk through anything and everything. When you let those shots go and it's just bouncing off and they're walking you down. It's so demoralizing. It absolutely breaks your heart. What else can you do? So that left lands. Exchanges from both men in this round. Wanted to land the left hook, but was not successful. This fighter's not shown as much defense at all. That counter shot lands. Someone tell these two that they can be defensive for a minute if they want to. This round could go either way. Ten seconds to go. The game plan does not... And there's the bell for round eight. Safe to say that last round was a nightmare. Let's see if we can turn it around here. This is not where Price wants to be. crashes to the canvas. One, two, three, four, five, six. So they'll make it up and this fight continues. is starting to run out of gas. What do you do as a fighter when you just don't have the energy? Now this is about desire. This is about character. This is about want. It's not about ever hope. Remember the fighter Ivan Holyfield? He could be behind on points until the last 10 seconds, but he's fighting like he's going to put it back. That's the kind of hope we need to see. Great counter right hand there. Punch, counter punch. Final 10 seconds here, and this has not been his round for sure. Boy, 
this next round is going to be crucial considering the knockdown we just witnessed. And there's the bell for round nine. Let's see how he bounces back here after getting dropped in the last round. Oh, listen to me. If I knock somebody down like that, that round, you know this round could be... Caution is being thrown to the wind. Didn't wait long to get back in and get engaged. These punches coming from every angle. They score again with the left hand. to the great equalizer in boxing, but when you know your opponent is relying on that so heavily, how do you deal with it? You've got to be courageous when you're getting in there with someone that's bigger, stronger, and faster. You've just got to use brain there. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. It's a very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other, because no one dare do anything out of turn. Scoring blow. A very competitive round with 10 seconds left. A beautiful counter punch. From this moment forward, he cannot afford to lose another round. Every second, every. And there's the bell for round 10. Safe to say that last round was a nightmare. Let's see if we can turn it around here. That was a tough last round. Now you've got to make sure he doesn't put it on him. That's what he's going to try and do. So tie him up, hold him, lean on him. Don't get drawn into a fight. Not yet, not until your senses have come back. There's a right hand. How nervous would you get when you know you're facing a big puncher like this guy that can seriously hurt you? So one who draws first blood count. That's what you've got to look at. If you get and you know you're in there with a banger, you've got to be on it, but you've got to be confident. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. They're so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's going to be a hard night tonight for the judges. We're at the halfway point of this round, and both of these fighters have had their moments. Still could go either way. Right hand. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. Good counter punching for both these fighters. They've got the momentum, they've got the advantage. How do they carry that? Here we go in the championship rounds, round 11. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. A much better game plan here. Seeing the pass from the spider, they don't get concerned when they lose some of the earlier rounds because they know they've got that power that can strike at any moment. Sometimes when you get in there with someone that's so powerful, you're thinking you just gotta be smart than them. You've got to be like a little fagin and pickpocket. On the right. And this is a you hit me hard, I'll hit you hard type of fight. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. Back and forth they go in this round. The momentum continues to shift. And this is that jab. shot perfect counter shot a very competitive round with 10 seconds left as bad as boxing 
judging could be sometimes, there's no doubt who won that round. As long as they don't get complacent. Who thought we would have made it to 12? Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. Power is obviously the great equalizer in boxing, but when you know your opponent is relying on that so heavily, how do you deal with it? That power, that power might be the do or die. That power might be the, the, the equalizer. Good counter right hand again. It's knockout or bust for both of these fighters. We want an action and they are delivering. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. Perfectly matched, skill for skill, tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you, and so I gotta respect both of them more than happy. Hey, those punches add up. It doesn't always pay to be first. It pays to be last. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. So two judges are in agreement, but that's all you need in this game. A majority decision win. Told you all right, we don't see this that often. But when we do, we really remember. And this is one of those fights. Majority decision, I agree, you agree, the fans agree. Sorry, am I talking for you? All right, that's enough. Okay, you agree.